Hey everyone, what's up? This is Mike from TechniqueTV.com. So I've been getting a lot of questions on how I got my desktop to look the way it does. Because this is Windows 7, but obviously it does not look anything like a uh, usual Windows 7 install. You can tell by the taskbar differences and just the overall feel of it. So I got a question from a user named Mr. Quarsim. He wanted to know basically how he could get his computer to look like this, but he didn't want to replace any system files. He just wanted a simple .exe file that he could install that would do all this for him. So I'm happy to tell you guys there is a solution to what Mr. Quarsim wants. It's called UX Style Core. So what we're going to do is open our internet browser, and in the URL field, we're going to type in uxstyle.com and press enter. Now press play with the bits, blow up your PC in the process, click that. And once the file is done downloading, we can exit out of our internet browser. Now go to your downloads folder. And we're going to want to right click UX Style Core July 13th bits. Now press extract all and press extract and now you will be able to see the extracted files. Now depending on what type of Windows 7 system you're going to be using, you'll want to use a different file. x64 is for 64-bit systems and x86 is for 32-bit systems. You can check your system type by going to Start Menu, Control Panel, and clicking System. And you'll he see here 64-bit operating system so I'm going to be using the 64-bit one. And you do not have to run this as administrator. However, if you do get any problems, then be sure to run as administrator. And now I'll click Run. And I got this error message because I am actually using a patched version already of Windows that does not require UX Style Core to install a third-party style, visual style. So this will actually not work on my system because it has found that my UX my UX theme.dll and themeui.dll files have been tampered with. But I ran through the installation on a second computer of mine, and the installation is extremely straightforward. There's actually no options you need to choose. It's just the default settings, and all you have to do is just agree to the agreement. And once that is installed, Basically, you'll have a new process running in your task manager. It will be unsigned theme service.exe. Basically, what that is, is it's the program running in the RAM, but patching the memory that Windows 7 is using to install unsigned themes. So, it will add a little bit of overhead to the memory that Windows is using. However, it's actually not too bad. I think it's about 127k. That's literally nothing. It's just very minuscule compared to explore.exe. So you shouldn't have any problems with that. So once you have UX Style Core installed, you should just be able to go to deviantart.com or any other site like that and just grab a visual style and then just follow the instructions that the developer had to install it. So I hope you guys liked this tutorial. Thank you, Mr. Quarsim, for asking for this. Uh, if you have any suggestions or you found a theme that you like, uh, just be sure to post it in the comments. And don't hesitate to subscribe if you like our videos. Thank you.